Hi, welcome to Decibels Lab. Here are the steps to download the Autry Student Edition license. In this video, we are going to learn how to download and install the Autry, Autry Student Edition license, which we will be used for our upcoming courses. Let's start. This is the URL of the Autry University. This is a student tab where we are going to request for the license. This is a student form. We have to give some basic in, basic details. And for generating the license, it may take five plus working days. Let's fill the form. In any of the in internet browser, search for Altair University. Altair University, Global Academic Program. Here, student tab is there. If you come down in the student tab, free edition, free student edition. Here, we are going to request for the license. Request now. This is the student form. We have to fill the details. In the school, we have to keep the decibels lab only and other details as per your academics. Occupation I'm keeping student. Here the email address is there. You have to keep the valid email address or your personal email ID so that you will receive the executable links and license file for the mentioned email ID. Here the Ethernet host ID is there. Click on the host ID tool for Windows. If you click on the host ID tool, you will get one host ID. Detected host ID is there. Copy it. And paste in the student, student form. Here, you can paste it here. And just say continue. If you continue means we are requesting all day. We are requesting all day for the license file. For generating the license, it may take five plus working days. After you receive the after you receive the mail from Altair, you will get one file attached with the mail. License underscore lic dot dat. This is a license file which they will be sending with the mail only, and they are going to send some links to download the pro Altair products. This is the Hypermesh executable file which we have downloaded using the student edition. You have to install this file edu. 2021 underscore v64. This is the executable file which we can install the Altair, Altair Hypermesh. After installing, after installing the Hypermesh, we have to place the license file in the particular folder. This is the license file which we will be receiving in the, with the mail only. Let's copy this file in the installation path. Go for C drive. See, in this C drive, I'm going with the program files, Alt A, 2021 underscore edu, security, see, C drive, program files, Alt A, 2021 edu, security. Here, we have to paste that license file which we received in the mail from Alt A. Altair underscore LAC dot that. The file format should be this only. Don't alter the file. Now we have pasted the license file in the program folder. Now we have to change some environmental details so that every time if you want to open the hypermesh, it can fetch the data from the environmental settings. Go for control panel.
in the control panel system security in that systems in the system i'm going with the advanced system settings click on the advanced system settings here the system properties tab will open in this in the, the bottom bottom corner bottom right right side corner environmental variables tab is there click on the environmental variables in that system variables one tab is there here we have to add it see i have already added i will show you you have to choose the new new one and the variable name should be alter underscore license underscore path thing should be in the capital letter only and the variable value is the license path which we have saved in c drive see program files all day 2021 security this is the dat file which we have saved once you created the new one it will reflect like if it will reflect like this see variable and the values there we have filled the form we are requested for the license and after receive after re re request they will they are going to send us some executable links with the license file after the license file we have seen where we have to keep the where we have to keep the license file and how to change the environmental variables and all after after and changing the environmental variables we are able to work with the hypermission thank you please if anything if any if, if any information required please write to admin@decibelslab.com thank you